everybody today i'm going to show you how to configure your broadcast myself welcome to rigro digital radio broadcasting please carefully see the steps so that you can understand how to configure your uh, centua control panel with this broadcast myself software so i'm clicking this quickly we'll start up with the process now here these are the feathers this is for the mic this is for the music underlay music and this is for the mic on off button right now it will not blink so yeah so quickly i will show all these options later on we'll go to the settings menu click on the settings you can just select the folder where you want to put in your music wherever choose the folder you can choose otherwise you can just go back then you can quickly go to output mode select shoutcast server output settings now this is a little important and tricky kind of just see closely or just understand how this happens now i will log in to my account here now here if you'll see this is your dashboard of centua control panel here if you go you will find quick links click on the quick links and quickly you will see certain things out here now you, this is your stream start page this this will play your radio on the browser you don't need any of this what you need is here you have to go here now you will see a live source connection now enter this information into your live source software to perform a live broadcast that means you have to put in this information in your live software now this option you have to tick because you have to use this option sorry uh, if you are broadcasting your centova and you want to broadcast you know from your uh, Uh, say uh, auto control dj mounts that means if you want to use broadcast myself or you want to use sam broadcaster then you have to use these settings now what are those settings here you will see there's a shoutcast v1 if asked you have to put this value if not you have to leave it in sam broadcaster it will ask you for v1 but in broadcast myself it will not so now server host now i'll just copy this and I'll, and your port number is 8057 i'll just paste this information right here in the host name the name out here is different but remember the host name is the same thing that i have copied from here server host name okay here they have only mentioned host name now port what was the port 8057 right just simply say okay don't use the port name that is given to you in your now this is done main now most important now most most important you have to understand now this password now what is that password the password is when you create a password here now you have to create a new auto dj account so click on the dj's here i will show you how to create the dj account click on the dj say we'll mention here as now this radio is called as anar dana 1 I'll make the same password, or let's say, a Nardana DJ. I'll use the same as password also to make it more simple. Oh, I made a mistake here. It should be this. I'll use the same as the password. Okay. 
password confirm password paste real name paste and enable leave everything aside now this is asking for permissions you can just select all if you are the main admin otherwise if you want to give it to somebody else to use this auto dg account you can just select what access you can give probably to a newcomer or somebody who is new to you you should not give this access this access and uh, probably why should you let him know how many listeners are there don't give give a very selected app access don't give full app ftp only give him media limited access so that he can only access your media files and upload your files in this case i will give you all the access because i'm using this as a main account now if you want to you know give disk quota you can mention that if you want the auto dj to be given particular timing say for example morning 9 to morning 8 of 8 am to 8 am you can mention this but for this particular account i'll give him the full access for this auto dj now now remember most important thing is you have to first see how many listeners are there because i will need to restart the computer there are only five listeners so if i restart these five listeners will get disconnected i don't want to do that so i'll quickly go here to the broadcast myself and in the password i will put in anardana one second yes paste then colon then again anardana dj same password this is most important that's it you are done with this press okay oops there is some problem oh oh yeah it's done i'm sorry for the delay so yeah now you can tick this auto reconnection on failure that means when the internet goes it will auto reconnect choose the bitrate that you have already been given i think here is 96 kbps say okay then if you want to record this to the sd card you can say this because whatever you are doing the re- you are doing you will need to record it and you can just choose a folder where you want to record it i mean which folder uh, you want that recording to be so that you can use the same recording in your sam broadcaster or in your centova so now finally it seems everything is correct now i will change this live from say us a us a studio just mention this so that this line will appear when the radio is live from it from the uh, broadcast mic that's it you're done just now you're done it will not work unless and until you exit this app so exit this app completely i'll do redo i'll just exit this app completely this is little rigid it doesn't go so easily you you have to forcibly exit the app now again you will see the app is here so you have to click it and exit it exit yes now it is gone so now just launch the application just on this button 